Alright guys, what's up? My name is White Dragons and welcome to the show. So, uh, last episode I told you I was going to build the frame and been a little busy. Uh, I have a mining furnace area right now, but I'm probably going to move it in here and start working on getting things done. Um, I figured since I fell off of there, I better go ahead and record. Um, but this is going to be what Alta wanted. Alta wanted a castle, so she's getting a castle because she's the boss one way or another so uh, this will be the actual upstairs area we're gonna wall this in um, it's actually gonna go uh, kind of around where you're actually gonna have a pathway where you'll be able to walk all the way around uh, the area and come in here and then be able to go up uh, show you the height of the tower real quick while I have the opportunity to talk uh, I did screw up on the stairs. That was my fault. But there you go. Um, I'm running out of coal. I'm running out of coal. I'm running out of coal. But I'm also running out of uh, cobblestone. So I'm probably going to wind up having to do some mining. So maybe we'll get a couple more diamonds, maybe. Hopefully. Would be nice. Uh, I have not created the uh, nether portal yet. I need to get that done. Um, because we need glowstone to light this bitch up. Because it's... Um, it's pretty big, so uh, we can actually even go uh, another story if we need to. Uh, I set that up. I put lots of windows in everything because, well, I like windows, and windows look good because you can see everything. We're going to plan on putting the village out there, hopefully. Um, but, uh, yeah, that's, this is pretty much what I've been doing. I'm going to do for the next couple of days. Um, my survival series is running, but it's going to be running like once a week. Um, because again there I have to actually stop in mine. This is actually the framework for the towers. Uh, one and one, so there's going to be four all together. This is what's taking forever, making these damn stone bricks. Um, and I, we're probably going to wind up, I don't know exactly, but we may use the jungle wood for the floor and whatnot, but I'm probably going to move the mine, not mine, the, I can't I keep calling mine, I'm probably going to fix the stairway here where it needs to be, how it needs to be looking, uh, because the idea here is you're going to walk to the door and you're going to be able to go straight up the top, I swear that cat knows when I'm doing this I freaking hate that cat so much anyways, um so I may put the furnaces right here and have this all workshop area, I don't know yet Anyways, I just wanted to show you what was going on, and uh, keep you updated. Thanks. We've got the floor done here, and there's my cat, and we've got the top portion done. It's not all the way. I have to make some ladders because I fell from there. Um, put doors on. I moved my bed in here. Also, let's get move hers. Damn it. Uh, moved up to iron for a little while just because I needed to break blocks super fast. Then we have our wonderful, lovely cat guards. Hello, cat guards. And uh, you've seen what we did here. This will be where the village will be at. And we cut the tree down over here. Missed a spot. To keep things from spawning. And let's go check out and see what Alta Solo did. Uh, it looks like shit. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. Here, let me take that from you. And we'll put it right here. How about that? Yeah, how about that? Yeah, you got your very own crafting bench. Huh. You're so special. <laughs> oh, shit, I got more wood right here. I forgot about. I was like, how am I going to make a fence? And I remembered. Or a gate. I was like, oh man, this sucks. I don't have enough sticks. And I was like, oh yeah, I got, I got sticks right there. Duh. Alright, and then we'll put our gate in right there. There we go. So, I'll, I've got some, um, I got some glass somewhere. It's either here, or it's in there, or there's another couple of, um, what do you call it, chests that are underground. I'll find it and see. Sheep, get the hell out of my garden. But what I want to do is I actually want to uh, go three blocks high with uh, with the glass. So that will put it above this one. And then on the outside, put, uh, put 
a row of uh, plant pain that way uh, when you're looking at it and you see a spider the spider can't climb up because there'll be a, a ledge right there <clears throat> FYI and I say this every time if you don't know um, creatures cannot break or zombies cannot break trap doors that's why you have one on your mine shafts and you know you put one everywhere and the way I'm doing it like this and I'll show you if you uh oh that needs to go on this side because you'll get stuck if you don't actually I'll just go ahead and break these and show you so you know what I'm doing and then I'm going to end the episode because I'm going to want to go to bed so if you put your door on the outside on the inside like that and then take your trap door put it on the outside inside like this the door registers the air block as a block so the door will be right there and this will be right here and that opens up that way which we don't want to do that we want it to open the other way what the fuck how did you get in here how did you get in here dude there's no dark area how did you get in here there's no dark areas. Cat, how do you get in here? Hmm? 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 That's weird. I need this door opening up the other way. So we're going to have to break this one. And then we're going to break out this one. That's weird. Yeah. Oh, I mean, oh, I know what I gotta do. I gotta do it from the inside. Yeah. Okay, so we can do it like. Oh, shit. Too close. There we go. Okay, let me go do it right there. Alright, so now when somebody opens the door. Uh oh. Nope, gotta do it from this side. Dang it! The idea is the door has to open inward. There we go, like that. And then the gate, the tra trap gate, trap door goes there. There you go. Awesome. Wow, I cannot believe that jerk got in my house. That's so weird. So I don't know how he got in. All right, let's make that. All right, and then we're gonna make two buttons, and then I'll show you the reason why we're making buttons, and why the reason why we're making these things. So, you put a button here, it's not gonna work, right? But if you put a button here, that's not gonna. Well, that doesn't work neither. You see, I gotta put a button there. Okay. All right, so. Let's say you don't want to. You're being. You want to be lazy. You just click that. Open that. All right. And now we put the trap. We put the pressure plate right there. And there you go. And I'm leaving it up so just in case the cat actually gets pushed. There you go. See. Then close that. So your entrance way will always be the easiest. Whoopsie. Get in there. But then you can close it right behind you. So that's emergency. Shut up. But this is lazy. Just because I'm just lazy. <laughs> I'm just lazy. That's the best way to describe it. I'm kind of waiting till dark because I want to know where all these. Unless it was right here. Could have been right here. I hope not. That means every time I add on something, I'm going to have to freaking, like, torch it up again. That's why I need to get to the nether. Get some, get some, uh, whatchamacallit. What do you call them? Glowstone. I'm not really worried about up there. They don't normally spawn. Architecturally wise, architectural wise that looks like shit. So we're going to get rid of it. I liked it like that. Yeah, it looks better. We'll actually turn this into a kitchen area. For now. 
Yeah, we'll turn this into the food storage area. So we really don't have to much worry about if we... Oh, I left the glass in the other place. This is why I want the underground thing. Because it shits over there, shits over here. Anyways. Um... I'm looking for any more dark spots. Does anybody see any? I see one right there. So if we go right here and then put torches. One torch and two torch. We'll go ahead and light that thing up. Hmm, go. Got another dark spot right here. Damn it, I didn't want this to be too long of an episode. I wasn't gonna, I didn't think to run into this problem. Okay. There's, no, how is that a dark? Okay, why are these not? Huh. Do these, do these even matter? No. I thought putting the torch there would be okay, but apparently I was wrong. Go fuck yourself. I mean, go mess with yourself, spider. Nobody loves you, so go away. And the reason why I'm putting down lower is obviously because I want to ensure that light reaches everything. So, I'm just going to drop these real quick. And I can do, I'm going to do a lot of this. I need to stop. I need to stop because I can do a lot of this off camera instead of on camera. Because this is just, this is just maintenance. That's all this is. That's all this is. is main, maintenance, figuring out the quirks. So, when you build big areas, just make sure you put your torches down low enough to where the lighting won't be affected by it. Or you'll have a zombie banging on your door. From the inside, yeah, yeah, that does make a difference. Yeah, that does make a difference. Yep. Get rid of all this. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Likes, comments, greatly appreciate. It. As always, we do this for fun, not for profit. Yes, you're getting this lovely entertainment for free. And Mr. Cat, do you have anything to say? Okay, that's Meow Talk for get the hell off. You're wasting time. So, and feed me. Feed me. Not the cheap shit, neither. <laughs> Alright, thanks guys. Bye.